This is the story of old J-Bo. Leading the lambs to the slaughter. It's so funny. Seeing how stupid people are. And they reveal it when they be on the internet. Be like raving and stuff like. Yo, listen to what Jigga said. He told y'all to change clothes. And y'all went in there and changed clothes. <laughs> Stop wearing jerseys and start wearing button up shirts. He came out and said, this is the death of all the tunes. <laughs> y'all went crazy. Man, Autotune sucks, man. Y'all bought all those Autotune records. <laughs> now you telling y'all what? You can buy the block. <laughs> Get your credit score up. Okay. Go buy go buy two million dollar paintings. Right? Old J Bo. Mm, mm, mm. Well, I'm gonna count money while I do this. Off the dome. Because this is, you know, J Bo's motivation. The dollar. <laughs> the almighty dollar. So, J Bo. He promoting black power, black businesses. But how many blacks do you have working for your businesses? I know what this is. You the boss, then who is Michael Rapino? Yeah, I know. Old j -Bo. <laughs> He want us to believe that we could achieve and have what he has in his status just by going out and doing it on our own. With no help. Where's the hand? Not the handout. But you make it seem like that's what we all about. We not all pulling at your pockets, ho. Put together a project or a plan for the brothers, ho. Since that's what you want to go by. Like you the almighty, but you might just be the deceiver. A rapper, voice for the crackers. You talking all this talk, but where's the action? And we can't buy the block hole. They not selling it. So your high credit score is kind of irrelevant. Instead of you preaching unify, you supporting the gentrification that's happening around the nation, even in your Brooklyn. Crown Heights, they pushing people down to Brownsville with the rats and roaches to live. But I guess that's the way it is, huh? Yeah, I know. What can you do? You just hold. <laughs> yeah, we know. Yeah, we know. Now, he prays black ownership, but you just replacing your face in the place of the old slave master. You want to hold Kanye West hostage because you won't be your bastard. You made your money off the sweat and brow of him and others before him. There's people laying dead in Marcy who helped you get to the plateau where you at and you didn't even tick your tiptoe back to the funeral roll. Didn't even pay for a reef. Didn't even come to the hood and show your rabbit rat looking teeth. To send the family and say, here's some money. Or how could I help at least? But this is the guy y'all believe. OJ Bo. <laughs> yeah. That's your man's. That's your man's. Talking about how he was unfaithful to the one that he said that he gave his life to. Oh, he's so great because he admitted it after about, what, 10 years of doing it. Oh, my gosh. So did he really love her? Or did he love what they could create off of her? I don't know. <laughs> oh, just the mind of a poet, man, and I know it. It's so clear and pure. Just come flowing right out. Story of old J-Bo. 
This man put himself up there. He's Todd's most influential. He want to be with the Eggers and the Murdochs. Murdochs facing sexual harassment charges. Racketeering charges. Up at Fox News. Spending money to degrade the Obamas. But that's the one who you praise. You praised Murdoch. You praised that you can have your name mentioned in the same sentence with him. But you chilling with Obama. So what is this? I don't get it, ho. Oh, j -Bo. That's your man. That's your man. I'm out. I had this on a, a instrumental too, but I knew they were gonna find some way to flag it. So I had to do it a cappella. You know, I just was going off on that instrumental. It's hard. Woo! Woo -hoo! Man, I mean, it came out in rhyme form. And, you know, ain't no need to write nothing down. So you just come right off the mind. Oh, God. If I had a recorder for that, jeez. I said, man. This, this instrumental so hard, and I just spit it out like that. I I need to go ahead and, and, and record that. <laughs> and then I'm like, nah, you know what they're going to do, man. <laughs> they're going to come hard, hard after me, knowing everything I said is true. Every word I just spit about old J-Bo, y'all have known ignored, and ain't done nothing. Where are the trade jobs? Trade jobs in Brooklyn has went up and been on the rise. Why the brothers don't have these jobs? Talk about that, J-Bo. Talk about unifying. How are we going to come together and strategize? We can't buy a $2 million paint home. I'm sorry. We can't afford it. Sorry. Maybe someday we can get up there and get that $2 million paint. But right now, we can't do it, brother. We just can't. Help us out. Give us the knowledge. <laughs>